find me as Inbound Shaker. I'm a Splunker for around 10 years. Outside Splunk, I do traveling, reading, photography. The God of Small Things is a Booker Prize novel from our India. Hope some of you guys may already remember that one. So today's agenda would be very brief, very small overview of IT service intelligence. Just some concepts, terminologies, how to do some, how to just navigating the IT essay, that's all, nothing much. So this is the Splunk observability portfolio. You can see that it starts with the third party ecosystem at the lower side. The locks are coming to the infrastructure monitoring. The infrastructure monitoring is another app, another Splunk app. Performance monitoring is a Splunk app, digital experience. All these things are different apps. This layer is service monitoring and insights. This is what the ITSA tool takes care of. Above ITSA, there are in other, other areas like event management, incident management, automation, at the automation, the SOAR, IT operations, the engineer, the engineers would be on the front end, guys. So this one is just a self-explanatory, nothing much. Moving to this one, service health. The, the business service health, particularly after the COVID, the applications have changed a lot. So the application monitoring solutions also changed a, a very much, changed a very much. Lot. So monitoring these things, taking care of the incident risk, the taking care of the incident management became a very big burden for SOC teams or security monitoring teams. You can see that the infrastructure, there are very big variety of infrastructure up to applications. Then there are application services, then there are business services. On top of that, the KPIs. KPI meaning key performance indicators. So the next one, the business outcomes. By using the Splunk ITSI, we can predict the outages 30 to 45 minutes in advance. That is what the business outcome for using the ITSI. So, this is a very nice, one minute, let me start the slideshow. Yes, so you can see that Splunk got many other tools like APM tools, Infra tools, DevOps, etc. So the services are, there are two services, technical service and business service. The KPIs are like a key performance indicators, meaning the CPU, average latency, the disk storage, this, that, this, that. Business services are like the number of customers, number of transactions, number of logins, login failures, success, this, that, this, that. Adaptive thresholds are meaning, uh, we will see the adaptive thresholds later, later. So the service health score, the ITSA guys assign some service health score, which we can monitor this technical service or business services. And then there is an alerting. Alerting stands just between the two. Alerting combines the KBA, KPIs between technical service and business service. The clash tables. The clash tables are the front end of the Splunk. They give very good, very good dashboards for the presentations. So incident management, you can see the SOAR automation, many this, that, 
anomaly detection is what the ml machine learning tools team by rca predictive analytics so many tools and so many that is why this is the the itsa is a premium solution guys so okay i already have the login let's go to the system so this is the itsa service intelligence just i will give us very small very brief gui walkthrough that's all nothing much we will not do any other things so let me do some more you can see the very nice service analyzer tree kind of structure you can see easily which service are currently overloaded so when i click on the on any of anywhere i will get a complete kpi information about that particular tree particular branch so you will see that whether it is the status is normal or whether is there any issues or from partic particularly from which time time stamps everything when you click open all in deep dive it will give us okay you can see this one the timeline wise information particularly you can compare this with uh, you can do average maximum medium some lines this that this that you can compare the, this one with yesterday last week this that okay looks like some information is not available select all time compare with last week okay no problem so the service analyzer gives yeah when you click on the service analyzer like this there are tree form and let's do this one the service analyzer got two shapes like a tree shape tree shape just we have seen tile view tile view gives a simple tiles kind of thing very nice one for sometimes you can see that which the top 50 kpis you can see that which kpis are struggling i should say struggling so a very very nice dashboard i should say there are analyzers service analyzers just helps the creates the other the tree structure and the tile and tiles if you click the infrastructure overview we will have this one this gives very good uh, details about the infrastructure there are no sub sub other dashboards under infrastructure overview let's go to the episode review very custom dashboards creating this these dashboards manually will will be almost an impossible task for a normal splunk admin even for architect so you can see that mean time to resolve episodes by severity this that this that okay glass tables glass tables is another important feature available only with itsi and enterprise security it is not available with the normal splunk enterprise okay let's click on the infrastructure health so department wise it gives very nice view it says all 100%, but uh, there should be something else. Uh, it's all the glass, glass tables are drill down uh, options available. You can see when we click on the glass tables, it goes to the particular deep dive. Okay, let's go to the deep dive directly. 
so we got only one deep drive Cre we can create a deep drive also these features are not available for splunk enterprise this is available only for itsi and enterprise security there are some dashboards like predictive analytics Okay, looks like it says you must use a machine learning toolkit. Okay, not needed for right now. Event analytics. I believe this also may. Okay, this got something. Um, select a panel, skip the events. The business service informations are very much available, detailed. Okay, ITSC health check. How is the ITSC performing? You can change the timestamps here. You can see which search queries took run and how many times, what was the exact search query, everything. That is what the health check configuration how we can how we can improve or uh, customize our idsa that is what the configuration search is a regular search so let's go back to the presentation so service in idsi this got a uh, there are two broader groups, technical services, business services. I think these things are self-explanatory. Okay, challenge one, navigate certificate service analyzer. Okay, for the time being, we will close the close this demo. From the next from the next day onwards, we will have a little more demo or workshop kind of sessions, so that you guys can start learning. The Splunk. There are many other videos for installing the Splunk. Maybe I will try to create some other videos as well. You have to have, a, you can download a free enterprise Splunk. Just create a, doc, a user also it's on the Splunk.com page. There are some sample data sets available. You can load the data, data sets and then do searching. The premium apps, we cannot, uh, you, you may not be able to do some testing with the pre premium ones, but uh, I will try to teach you as much as possible. Hope you guys learned something from this video. See you on the next video. Thank you. Bye.